Okay, uh, next one is the uh, definition of sustainable development. So, ini mudah je lah. Right? So, what is meant by sustainable development ataupun bahasa Melayu kita panggil pembangunan yang mampan. Mampan. Pembangunan mampan. Okay. And even uh, URA pun applying this sustainable goal and whatever tu kan. Okay. Alright. What is definition of sustainable development? Sustainable development is that whenever a country or a nation is developed economically, right, it must meet, uh, meet the need of the people today without limiting the ability of the future. Maksudnya apa saja pembangunan yang dikecapi pada masa sekarang mesti boleh uh, dikecapi juga oleh um, uh, generasi akan datang. So itu yang kita panggil sebagai sustain. Okay, right. Kalau satu negara tu membangun tapi still ada rakyat dia yang masih tertinggal di belakang, tak dapat education, uh, masih lagi miskin, uh, kesihatan tak 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 uh, tak ni tak dijaga dengan elok dan sebagainya. So that particular nation still is not uh, known as a sustainable country. Okay? Right. Sustainable development requires connection between life sciences, okay, perkembangan daripada segi sains, uh, social sciences, politics for example, okay, uh, economy and also Humanities must be comply. So baru kita panggil sebagai sustainable development. Okay. Alright. So the goal of sustainable development is to use politics and economy uh, to encourage environmental beneficial and more sustainable form of economic development. So maksudnya kita nak satu environment yang sehat supaya ekonomi lebih berkembang. Right. And discourage environmental that is harmful and unsustainable form of economic growth. So kita tak nak satu environment yang uh, mengecutkan uh, ekonomi. Uh, contoh macam banyak sangat bribe kan uh, here and there. Lepas tu riba banyak sangat. Lepas tu uh, penindasan, monopoli, bla bla bla. Tu semua tak mau. Okay. So, country in code Malaysia have gathered and agreed to ad adopt 70 uh, global sustainable development goal. Okay. So Kena hafalah yang 17 ni. Okay. Alright. So what are the 17? Uh, um, kata apa? Strategies of development goal. Satu, no poverty. Right. So satu, kita tak mau kemiskinan. Uh, so itu adalah salah satu goal untuk sustainable development. Okay. Economic growth must be inclusive to provide sustainable job and promote equality for all people to get job. Uh, so that is satu syarat yang pertama. Okay. Uh, so semua orang mesti um, kata apa dapat pekerjaan uh, and then kurangkan uh, kadar kemiskinan dan sebagainya. Second one is zero hunger. Okay. So the food and agriculture sector often a key solution for development and is the central for hunger and poverty eradication. So sekarang ni kalau perasan even Malaysia pun sangat menggalakkan uh, perkembangan daripada segi agriculture dan makanan. Uh, ada sektor Uh, kecil dan sederhana kan. Uh, so um, apa nama uh, pertanian sama ada kecil-kecilan dan sebagainya pun kerajaan support. Uh, so ini adalah salah satu cara untuk uh, meng mengurangkan kadar kemiskinan dan memberikan peluang pekerjaan kepada masyarakat. Okay. Jadi macam ahli politik yang dia cakap ni. Okay third. Uh, good health and well-being. So to ensure that healthy life and promoting well-being for all ages is essential to sustainable development. So dia nak pastikan semua orang mendapat uh, perkhidmatan kesihatan yang sewajarnya. Even dekat ceruk-ceruk mana sekalipun, kampung-kampung even uh, apa nama, uh, perkampungan orang asli pun ada klinik kan. Uh, so benda tu semua adalah untuk capai this um, third, third uh, sustainable development goal. Okay. Salah satu dia macam tu lah vaccination pun semua kita reach, try to reach to all age kan. Okay, next is quality education. So obtaining a quality education is a foundation to improve people's life and sustainable development. Uh, so that's why uh, kata apa, uh, ilmu ataupun uh, pembelajaran tu penting. So that's why in Malaysia pun adopt pembelajaran sepanjang hayat. Uh, macam tu kan, alright. So dia galakkan orang belajar seawal mungkin sampailah uh, semaksimal -se boleh kan. Okay, next is gender equality. So gender equality is not only a fundamental of human right but necessary foundation for peaceful, phosphorus and also sustainable. So uh, ni lah. 
Maksudnya uh, everyone sama ada lelaki atau perempuan has uh, equal chances uh, to get job and equal chance, chances to post a position in their company. Uh, macam tu, okay. Next is clean water and sanitation. Uh, sanitation. So uh, kita kena pastikan satu negara tu men 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 apa, menyediakan uh, apa nama uh, bekalan air yang mencukupi uh, kan dan uh, accessible. Uh, tu. Tapi kalau ada masalah yang time tak ada air tu kan, uh, tu minta maaf lah. <laughs> okay. Tu. Okay. And kalau perasan kan ada certain uh, negara macam dekat Australia ke kan, uh, dekat uh, US UK ke air pipe diorang tu pun boleh minum uh, sampai tahap macam tu. So maksudnya dia, dia, dia orang memang sediakan uh, air yang bersih lah. Uh, macam kita, negara kita, kita punya air pipe kita tak boleh minum. So kena pakai penapis dan sebagainya macam tu. Tapi uh, kita ada air uh, macam tu. Okay next one is affordable and clean energy. So uh, kena uh, what? Energy is the central to nearly every major challenges. So sekarang ni pun dah banyak ada kan. Uh, solar, panel dan sebagainya lah just to get more uh, reusable energy. Next is sustainable economic growth, right? Uh, decent work and economic growth. So uh, require societies to create condition that allow people to have quality job. Okay, even though orang-orang uh, yang dalam penjara pun dia beri, uh, orang kata apa, skills. Kan, uh, they are being polished with skills so that when they, whenever they are, orang kata apa, going out, meet people outside the world, so dia ada kerja, uh, apa benda yang dia boleh buat. Okay, so. Next is industry, innovation and infrastructure. So uh, a lot of investment uh, either from internal or from external is um, kata apa, important to develop the infrastructure lah suitable for the sustainable. Okay. Next is uh, reduce inequalities. Okay. Uh, so policy should be universal uh, to even accommodate uh, all ranges of uh, population. So uh, macam contoh even orang yang uh, ke kelainan upaya pun uh, kerajaan kita bagi slot ataupun bagi kota untuk pekerjaan and then even uh, dalam uh, universiti pun ada right uh, kota untuk pelajar uh, kurang apa nama kelainan upaya right and even they are being provided with um, facilities uh, so this one is to reduce in equalities okay next one is sustainable cities and communities right uh, by providing basic services right transportation and whatnot okay so even housing pun that's why kita ada rumah kos rendah rumah sederhana dan sebagainya so to meet the the kata apa level of each people okay uh, responsible consumption and production so this one is more on um, recycling okay uh, untuk reusable dan sebagainya tu okay next one is climate action so climate change is a global challenge that affect so uh, sekarang ni dah banyak sangat education yang uh, apa nama, uh, advertisement ke, campaign ke that is um, kata apa, uh, promote uh, saving uh, the universe kan, uh, saving the life underwater, okay, uh, saving the ocean dan sebagainya tu. Okay, uh, so ni uh, life below water, so there is careful management that is uh, to sustain the life of underwater, okay. 15, life on land pun sama. Kita kena sustain uh, forest, forest. That's why ada undang-undang yang uh, limit forestation, de uh, deforestation. Okay, and then um, apa kata apa, pemuliharaan dan pemuliharaan. Okay, uh, so tu semualah. And so on. Okay, the next one is peace, uh, justice and strong institution. Right, uh, so this one is a good political uh, institution that um, kata apa, uh, at all level. Uh, so tu. And last one is uh, revitalize the global partnership for sustainable development. So this one is more on kerjasama antara negara-negara uh, yang terlibat, right? So with the same aim which is to um, achieve the sustainable development goal, all right? So uh, that is all the 17 uh, developmental goals. So you can have file and you have to apply. Let's say we give you condition. So kita bagi situasi lah pasal contoh penambangan hutan, something like that. So is it a meeting, uh, is it a part of the sustainable development goal? So you have to understand that uh, these things ataupun situation given to you is meeting the 17 uh, de development goal. Okay. Right. So Islam and ecology in Quran. So Quran states that all that is in the earth has been subjected, sakhara, okay, to human in Surah 22, 
uh, verse 65, 65, and it is he who has created you uh, from all things that are on the earth. So Allah nak bagi tahu yang apa yang ada dekat sini adalah Allah yang ciptakan dan perlulah digunakan uh, dengan sebaik-baiknya. Okay, right. So, human have been uh, given special status uh, of uh, God from Allah as Khalifah. Alright, so when we are talking about Khalifah, so mestilah kita kena jaga environment kita dengan sebaiknya. Okay, macam itulah. Okay, and uh, so many other verse in the Quran that uh, mention about human hands, human hands that uh, give uh, harm to the uh, earth itself. So from there, kita akan dapatlah kesan daripada apa yang telah kita lakukan sendiri. Okay, alright, so uh, that's all. Finish with chapter. 11.